Hey, ladies. Hi, everyone. Let's see if I remembered. I think it's muted. Oh, yeah, it's muted. I turned off the whole volume. I'm still hey, waiting. Renee. Hey, Lenny. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Oh, come on. Mine's still going, too. Oh, there, there it goes. goes. 20 seconds. Mine, too. Wow. It's going to be one of those nights, you guys. I'm good, Renee. How are you? Come over here and make sure it's actually live. It is. Okay. So what's everybody been up to since since Monday? I had to stop and think what day it was. I did tell you it was colorful. It's a table full of color. Color. <laughs> cover. Color. Something. It looks awesome. Let's see what they say. Not bad. Anybody do anything fun? I went to the grocery store today. Was that fun? <laughs> well, I also just snuck in there to grab my coffee. Ha. Um, I don't know if it qualifies as fun, but it wasn't awful. I went to get two new tires today. <laughs> Ooh, now was that fun? Well. Nope. The loaner they gave me was really nice. It was a 2018 Honda Civic four-door. It has that little screen where when you back up, you know, you, you can see the back, but you yeah. also see the sides. Right. Which was real nice in a parking lot. Is it confusing, though, when you're not used to having it? It was a little confusing. I It was, I, it was funny because um, I took the kids to Chipotle for – so they could grab lunch. And as I'm backing out, it was almost like I didn't trust it. Right. <laughs> you know, but yeah, it's, it was nice. I wish my car had that. I feel like I would second guess it. Oh, Lori made cookies. She's devouring them. She said, wow. Yeah. What kind? Don't say chocolate chip. Don't say chocolate chip. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> Lenny, um, can you shoot me an email, please? I looked and looked and looked and can't find yours. I don't. I know you sent it. I just can't find it. So if you could shoot me an email, then I can get your invoice taken care of for you. Yeah, the sinus stuff. Renee, I'm right there with you. Mine's better, though. It's getting better. We'll see how the coughing is tonight. Seven layer cookies. Oh, I never heard. Oh, they're in. The, those are that the bar, right? It's got the you melt the butter oh. and the graham crackers and the coconut and the peanut. What is it? Peanut butter? No, butterscotch and chocolate chips and shredded coconut and condensed milk. I think. Wow. Hi, yeah. Natalie. Wow, Jody. Okay, Jody gets the prize for. Oh, she walked a mile to pick up her car. What? I walked a mile to pick up my car, broke my laptop, and had to drive to Cambridge to drop. Oh, my gosh. <clears throat> She's a loo. Right? Lori said yes, yes, yes. And <laughs> Natalie saw feed sacks. <laughs> <laughs> I figured she'd be elbowing her way to, to the front of the room. Natalie and her flower sacks. Yes, ma'am. Hey, Glennis. Oh, my goodness. So I'm going to, I really want to drink this coffee, but it's hot and the cup is entirely too full. So this could prove disastrous. We'll Hi, Marianne. Hey, Marianne. <clears throat> Let's see here. So since, hey, Colleen. Hi, so, Colleen and Christina. And Christina. Hey, so I know the puppy's so cute, right? Look at it. It's so cute. Yeah. So here's, I got, well, I only have like one housekeeping thing. I did figure out some online shipping. I've been printing labels. Everybody that got an email with a tracking number, those should all be activated and they should all, um, hey, Kathy. Um, they should all show that they've been dropped off and moving because they all went today. 
Hi, Pamela. Hi, Kathy. Hey, Pamela. <laughs> so more will go out tomorrow. I'm just going to, I'm just going to, um, for right now, it'll be like every day or every other day. I'm still bypassing my local, mm -hmm. you know, right down the street post office because <laughs> uh, it's still not good yet. You guys. He's still so new and he doesn't scan them in right. So I've just been hearing stuff from other people. He's still struggling. So still going to take him, you know, the next town over. So Glennis, that's my favorite piece on the table. You're looking <laughs> on this, this side of the laptop. This, <laughs> oh mm. my gosh. <clears throat> so yeah, we'll see. Okay, so that's all I have for like housekeeping stuff. Um, and for anybody that's new or not familiar yet, I do invoicing once once a week or every other sale, however you want to look at it, I invoice on Tuesdays. So invoices will include tonight and then Monday night, and then I'll invoice on Tuesday next week. So tonight and then this coming Monday. I would say the date, but I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what one day is yet. The date on Monday? Yeah, it doesn't matter. It's just, <laughs> I was just being silly. So what do you guys want to start with? There's, there's legit, let's see. So, all right, I'll start with this. This is, um, these are textiles that we're used to, right? These are things that we've been seeing quite a bit of. It's the embroidered stuff. It's the pulled thread. It's the old, um, Mm-hmm. To dry the dishes with dish, dish towels. Dish cloth, dish yep. towel. I could not think a towel to save my life. Then this pile is all embroidered. Everything. Wow. These are, yeah. These are all have embroidery on them in some way or another. Most of them are runners. So there's that pile. You guys can decide where we start. I'm going to put this with the embroidered. These are all grain slash feed sacks. I have a fly. Well, I did say it was 70 today, so there's that. So the there's these, and I have a whole nother basket of the grain sacks. I have a couple. I dug these out. I forgot I even still had these. These are those, um, remember the European hemp ones that, that I had. I think I have two of these left. And then there's just a bunch of um, <clears throat> other ones like these. So we could start with the grain feed sacks or we can start flower sacks. All of these are flower sacks. All of them. My gosh. Colleen says feed sacks. Okay. Glennis says embroidery. <laughs> yep. <laughs> In, it, I'm telling you guys. Hey, Terry, invoicing, it just stinks. I don't care. I'm mm -hmm. going to use that, you know, that horrible word. I know it's like the tackiest English ever, but it just sucks. Like, I hate it. Hi, it's Diane. My favorite part of this whole thing is the invoicing. It really is. I cannot wait till Mr. Malcolm of his of an age when Rosie can take over the invoicing. She wants to, and I can't wait. <laughs> Jen, anything. So you've got like one of each. You've got embroidery. You've got flower. You've got feed. You've got anything. <laughs> oh, hi, Jennifer Jane. She's hey, Jennifer. <clears throat> Oh my gosh, Patty. It's really the first time I've ever drank coffee out of a cup, evidently. I have dribbled. This is the third time now. This is what happens. I got in a hurry and I filled it too full. Paula says all of it. All of it. All of it. All right. Well, I'm going to make an executive decision. We'll start with the flower sacks and we'll get those out of our hair. So, and then we'll move to the feed sacks and then we'll do embroidery because then, because embroidery is what I legitimately, there's so much tonight, you guys. Um, when I picked up 
um, the stuff from that lady last weekend. There's so much embroidery. We could be here until okay. tomorrow. <laughs> Legitimately, we could sit here until breakfast, like no joke. So we can spend as much time as we want there. Um, some of the... I'm. Some of these are in, not in great shape and some are. What I want to know is, do you guys, like this one is, is pieces. This is not a full one. Let me get the ones out that are not full. That's not full. Those are full ones. This is a full one. This is full. This is full. This is full. And this is full. Okay, so these are pieces. We'll get to those in a minute. Okay, so hold on. That one's a piece. Wow, those are pretty. Yep. So, do you guys want me to flat price these, or do you want to do offer ups on them? I put that and I know there. some people are still struggling with the with the verbiage there, but it's just something I need to stick with. All saying flat so far. Okay. <clears throat> yep, flat. Okay. So some of these are in really nice condition all the way around. This one I know for sure has a hole in it. I <clears throat> left it out here so that I would see it. Um this one has some fading. Do you want me to open each one or do I, cause, because if I flat price them, I'm struggling. This one doesn't feel thick enough to be a whole one. Let me measure this one. I absolutely love this. Yeah. That's really pretty. It's different. It's so different. Hi, Angie. Hi, Deb. Hey ladies. Hmm. What happened to all the orange ones Jennifer Jane wants to know? You bought them already. <laughs> you did. I do have an orange um, embroidered piece that I want to show you and make sure you want it. If you want it, then it's yours. It's right here in the pile. Um, 34 <laughs> inches. So this one is just missing a couple inches in the length, but I feel like the print kind of makes up for that. This one is really different. Here we go. So I'm going to, if you guys are okay with it, I'm just, I'm going to price these as being imperfect. Imperfect, imperfect. I need to measure this one too. This one feels real thin too. That's really pretty too. It is pretty, right? Yep. They just don't feel as um, thick as the others. Hi, Janet. It's there. It's there, though, because typically these are between 34 and 36 inches. They're usually right at a yard. So, and this one's right at 34. So, we'll go with it. Okay. It's just really, just know that this one, um, just the fabric itself is a lot looser weave and it feels a lot lighter. So do you want to A and B them? I think we will A and B them. And I'm going to, let's see, I'm going to move them off the table. I'm trying to think of the least confusing way to do it. And do you guys want to limit them to one? You guys get to decide. Do you want to limit them to one per person or do you want, um, to just be able to, to just run with it. <clears throat> Diane says limit. Cause we'll do it whichever way you guys want. So there's that one, the ones with the big print, I'm going to open them up so that you can see them. There's, I think only the two that are like that. There may be one more. Limit. And I need my, st and I have my Ziploc bags, the super fun Ziploc bags that drive us all a little bit crazy, but they're awesome. Yeah. It's all limit 
and okay. plasmas allows people with a lag a better chance to get yep. one. Yep. And Works then if there's me. any left, then they, then, you know, yep. They can have more, right? Yep. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. These are the flower sacks you said, right? Yes, ma'am. So, yeah. And I'm going to price, um, these are going to be flat priced at 17. Okay. Okay. So we'll do that one and we'll do this one. So this one, um, the little plants go both directions. Mm. Oh, that's you, cool. It's different, right? It's so yeah. true. And any of these that aren't claimed tonight, I'll probably start a pile. Um, and this one, it does have a tear in it, just so you know, but it's right along the salvage. So, and like I said, I'm pricing them as being imperfect because I know there's a few that just have like a little random hole in them here or there. And unless I open them all back up, we're not going to know. So I'll just price them that way. And that way there'll be no disappointments. All right. Where did I put? There it is. Okay. I think it's okay to put in now. Yep, my, lag, right, my lag is 20 seconds. So. so yeah, mine's probably two minutes already. Gives me a chance to move some of this around while we're. And then we'll do the flower sacks and we'll move to the feed sacks. <clears throat> okay. And so then let me know when you're ready. Oh, I'm ready whenever you are. Okay. Uh, Jennifer Dane, Jane is taking A and Natalie Randall is taking B. Okay. Jennifer J. 17. See, these are those bags. Oh, yes. Yeah. The last batch wasn't like that, remember? Right. But these ones are. <clears throat> But the good news is <laughs> well, everything I mean, some gets, like the noise, some don't. <laughs> well, the good news is everything gets there really dry. Natalie R's. Okay. So then we'll do this one. I absolutely love this yeah, one. That's really pretty. <clears throat> she said she thinks she has another one of this. So that's why this one's on the table. Because if there's another one, I'm keeping it. So there's that one. So we'll put that one as A. And then this one will be B. And this is the one that I knew there was a hole in it. So it's right there on the top. Oh, that's cute. I like the colors in that. Mm -hmm. But see how they're like, they're right side up and then they're upside down. See like here, they're, they're upside yep. down. So it's just, this one's going to be fun to, to play with, I think. So whenever you're ready. Yep. Just waiting for YouTube to catch up here. Looks like they all want A. Yeah, I don't blame them. I would too. It's pretty cool. Okay. One of these okay, days, I'm going to next. Go ahead. Sorry. Becky gets A. Okay. And it looks like B is still available. Okay, so then mm -hmm. this one will be A. I like and this that. is red. Yeah, I don't know how it's coming across on YouTube yet, but it is it is red. Like vintage kitchen. I was going to say it doesn't it is coming across to me like as red, but not like a not a Christmas red. Right. A bright yeah. red. 
Yeah, it's that vintage kitschy red. Oh, look at the little Scotty dogs. Hi, Diane. Jean hey, said, I think, I think my dad had boxer shorts with that red print. <laughs> <laughs> Probably. Probably. Diane is going to take B. Diane, you said? Diane D, yes. Okay. And just waiting for the lag to see if anybody would like A. <clears throat> Probably any of these that aren't claimed, we'll do like we did last time. I'll cut them up into um, pieces and make variety packs out of them for you guys. Yeah, that's cool. Mm -hmm. Okay, so A. We'll leave A available. Oh available okay so oh wait a minute yep um kitty jen wants a okay so those are sold okay so this will be a So it looks like the deer, oh, look at there's an elephant. The deer has two different, depending on which way it goes, depends on which color its bow is. Oh, that's cute. I think everybody else has the same color bow all the time. So there's that one. And then there's this one. And that's a gray, the leaf, this bigger leaf is like a gray. That's pretty see what color it comes up on YouTube. I want to see if they're accurate colors. Yeah, so and mine, it's, yeah. it's pretty accurate. Okay. Yeah. Now, just to confirm, I, I know you said one each, but if somebody asked for B and A was still available, if somebody that already bought one, they could have A? Sure. Okay. Yep. Yeah, if nobody else wants it, yeah, it's fair game. Okay. pre-opening. <laughs> there we go. Okay, those are sold. Okay. Um, no one had asked for A, so Natalie Randall said A if not claimed. Okay. And then Christina Hill gets B. Okay. Hi, so Christina. Now, I can't remember if I said hi or not. Hey, Christina. Hi, Jean. Hey, Jean. A for Natalie. And then Christina Hill. Oh my gosh, these bags. Now, are you still using up the old ones or are these new ones and you didn't know that? Um, some of them, yes. yes and yes. Okay. <laughs> Hi, Beth. Hey, Beth. So this will be our A. Oh, I is, like that. Yeah. Is it coming across purple? The The background is purple. And there is some sun fading in this one just to be, it's not really picking up where it's faded. It's like, I feel like it was folded right here because there's a, there's a sun fade right there. And then right here. So just so you, oh, there, now you can see it. See, this side yeah. is faded and this side is darker just so you guys can see the fade on this one. 
Hi, Katie. Hey, Katie. Katie. To know if you could please have Patty read email. It's important. Sure. Like right now or when I'm done? And she hasn't answered yet. Natalie wants to know if she can split that last one with Jennifer Jane. Jennifer came in after her. Oh, the her one age. with the babies? Yeah, the, yeah, that I just need to, yeah, I just need to know if I'm splitting the price between the two of you. Okay. And then she here's said now, please. Yep. Give me one second. So here's that one. <clears throat> and that one. Oh, those are so pretty. Yeah. And this one, the colors are coming across pretty accurate. So this is like an aqua and then like an orange and then like a, um, uh, we'll call it like a foresty green. Yeah. They're saying <laughs> with the price, please. Okay. We'll do. I'll make a note on it here in just a second. Okay. Check in my email too. Hang yeah. on. Okay. Go ahead. Okay, that's in there. Hi, Deborah. Mm, gotcha, Katie. Thank you. I kind of thought so. Thank you very much for the confirmation there. Perfect. Okay. So, okay, so uh, Deborah Spiegel gets B. Deborah Spiegel. Hey, Deborah. Deborah S. It's B, you said, right? Yes. Perfect. All right, so I'll give it a few seconds. A is still available if anyone wants it that has already bought one. Let's see here. I'm going to split this one. Half Natalie. Half Jennifer. Oop, Jennifer only has one eye. Oh, my goodness. Half. You guys would think I'd never spelled out a name before in my life, right? <laughs> Jeez, Lou. Deborah said I wasn't said I wasn't going to spend I wasn't going to buy tonight. That didn't last long. <laughs> that didn't last long, did it? I know. It never I does, Deborah. Know. Okay, let me find Natalie's. Oh, it's right here. Wait a minute, Maggie, can you say go? I can't see the post and type at the same time. Well, I can say go, Terry, but you're going to see it in the chat before you're going to hear my go. Oh, she's on her phone. I see. I right. cannot. Well, maybe she, maybe she, if she won't then if she's got a really long lag. Right. Okay. Yeah, I can do that. Okay, so we'll leave A available. A's still available. Okay, so here, this one is going to be A, and this one is a light blue, a dark blue, a really pretty, like, I don't know, this is like one of those tricky, it's not moss green, it's not mint green, it's not a sea foam, it's kind of like all of those, mm -hmm. and then this is just a pretty pinkish color. Yeah, that's really pretty. And then... Oh, there was two of these. I don't know if any. So there's another one of these. Who got the other one? I thought I saw one that looked. Yeah, that there's looked, two of those. Yeah. yeah, there's two of those. Okay. Because here's the other one. Okay, here's my go, Terry. Hi, Lisa. Okay. 
Okay, Lisa is getting A. Which Lisa? Oh, sorry, Lisa Jameson. Lisa, J hey, Lisa. Lisa. J Hi, Leslie. Hey, Leslie. Hi, Tammy. And Tammy. You're missing, you missed some flower sex. Missed everything. Just kidding. Okay, Lisa J for A? Yes. And B is and available? B still available. Okay. So then this is our last one. And this is, okay, and that worked out really well, actually. Wow. Darn it, I wish I could say it was intentional, but it's not. So here's the deal. This one, someone has sewn together. Here's the stitch line right here. So you're actually getting two. So here's your stitch line. Somebody made, I don't know if this, I feel like it was a curtain because here's what I think would have been a rod pocket. Oh yeah. Have a rod pocket pocket for the rod. However, we want to say that, right? And then here's one here. So and one was a hem, one was the pocket. I'm not sure. But this one, um, you're actually getting two sacks. There is some wash wear and there is some sun fade. Just know that. Wow, that's really pretty. It is really pretty, right? That just screams like vintage, right? Kitschy. Yeah, just so pretty. Okay. Oh. Yep. Hi, Mary. Hey, Mary. Okay. So that one is going to Mary. Okay, cool. Thanks, Mary. Thank you, ladies. You guys are pretty awesome. All right, so then we'll do those pieces here in a second. Let me get Mary caught up here. Okay. So. Oh, uh, Becky wants to know if she can get the red and white B. Yeah, this one, honey. You said Becky, right? <clears throat> yes, Becky. You sure can. And Beth says, Patty, take my wrench away so it's not confusing. I'm going to bonk you over the head with it. <clears throat> okay. Perfect. Thanks, ladies. Let's see here. Let me get Beth. Well, oh, my gosh. It keeps moving on me. <laughs> you um... Okay, type again, Beth. I think I got it. Yes, Maggie? Um. Lisa's asking what didn't what didn't sell. I was going to say, do you want to show the ones that were still available just to see if anybody wants yep. them? Yep, there was these two. Okay, wait a minute. I'll put that in as A and B. Yep, and I left the hole up here so you guys knew. And these are priced for anybody that came in after we had started, knowing that they're imperfect. Like this one has a lot of sun fade on it. This one has a couple holes in it. <laughs> you know, we're just assuming that they've got issues or a little bit of damage. Sometimes you guys get a little crazy with these. Right. Okay, this is going in, Terry. I'm going to give it a second just to see if anybody comes in that. Yeah, you're fine. Thing. You're fine. They're sold anyway, but. Whatever you say, Megs. Okay. I'm, I'm the boss. Just along, I'm just along for the ride. What do I I'm do? the boss? You're the boss. <laughs> we are not the boss of me, but you're the boss. <laughs> well, that's no fun. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, you were just a little too excited there. I was like, right. oh, I might need to put some qualifiers on that. Right, Shelby? Maggie has the power. All the power. All the power. Okay, so Lisa Jameson's going to get A, and Mary will get B. Okie dokie. Lisa mm. Jameson for A. Lisa Jameson. Do you guys reuse these bags, or do you pitch them? 
I reuse them. Good. And then Mary, you said gets B, right? <clears throat> they reuse. Tim reuses. Tammy reuses. Cool. That's that helps with the expense of them. Helps just oh, okay, Lorna. She said I could be the boss of her, but only for tonight. <laughs> Deb, Maggie, I'd like to get a one-time discount on some flower sack. Oh, because I'm the boss. Now I get it. Ha! <laughs> but I'm not the only one. Okay, I better leave these there for a second. So these pieces are all different um, sizes. Each one of them is at least fat quarter. And I think, I'm going to double check them. I think they all go to the salvage. So like... Let me get to where I can find, there we go. So this one is 14 inches and then you've got the full, the full width, but there's several pieces of this. So this one where I'm just going to, we're not going to A or B this one. Okay. It's going to be however many pieces there are three and I just folded them different and I didn't do all the laundry Rosie help. So we fold different. Four. Are they each going to be different priced? No, these are going to be flat priced, all the same price. Okay, so there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven of these. And I'll open this one back up to show you. So, like, again, you do the upside down, right side up. So, like, upside down, right side up. But there we go. Hi, Lucy. Um, okay, so these will all be all seven pieces for the 17? No, there's going to be no. seven pieces. Yeah. Seven pieces available. Right. For, I'm going to do them um, $4 a piece. Oh, so different one, people yep. can get them. Seven different people could get them. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yep. Now I get it. Jeez, it's okay. That's okay. I was probably just about as clear as mud there anyway, so it's all good. <laughs> okay, Lucy, I asked at the plastic store today if I could get the discount for aunts of an employee ex-girlfriend. <laughs> <laughs> and did they say yes? That's what we want to know. <laughs> and by the way, hey, Lucy. Okay, you ready? Yep. Okay, Natalie Randall. Okay. Jennifer Jane. Hi, Karen. Hey, Karen. How are you? Uh, Mary. Mary. Got it. Diane D. Got it. Uh, Deb. Deb W. No, wait a minute. Deb C. Deb C. Deb's crafting room is Deb C, huh? Yep. Got it. Okay, Terry. Terry R. Yeah. And the last one goes to Karen Thompson. Nice. Thanks, ladies. Okay, so those are sold. All mm -hmm. right. So those I will add to your bags later. Then this one... There's two pieces and they, they go the same, they're cut the length. So you only have one salvage edge and probably about 14 inches wide. And this one, we're going to call it the same because it's just going to be the first two me's and these are going to be $4 also. Okay. If we had a bunch of big pieces left, I was going to hang on to these partials and cut them up into the packs, but mm -hmm. clean them all. I'm hoping I get one. She said she has a bunch more for me to come get this weekend, too. So I'm hoping there's more flower oh, sacks. My goodness. I know. I'm hoping there's more flower sacks. Okay, those are sold. 
Let me just see if anybody hasn't bought yet. Okay. Um, Lenny hasn't bought yet. Okay. Lenny P. So she's one. Okay. And then... Wait a minute, Reagan. Jennifer. Deborah Spiegel got one, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. Um, let me scroll. Now I need to scroll back up. Okay, Natalie Randall was the first me. Okay, dokie. There go. Thanks, ladies. <clears throat> and there's one piece left. And this one is larger, but it's a goofy, I don't know. It's it's a mess. Like, see, it's like somebody took oh. a big one. Yeah, so you've got like the across and then you've got the length. So, I mean, there's plenty there to use, but, you know. In so, price? Um, let's just do, um, let's just do six on it. Let's There's just, a lot on there. Yeah, there is. There is some, just do four on it for me, Maggie, please. Cause there's some bleeding. If you didn't put it in already. Oh, I haven't. Okay. Cause some of the color has run and stuff. Okay. We'll just do four. What the hey? We'll just do four. Oh, Terry. Hey, Tamar. Hey, Tamar. Okay, that's going to go to Tamar because she didn't get one. Okay. <clears throat> so for anybody who wasn't here in the beginning, I did say that I finally put my big girl pants on and I did some online label printing for your packages. So that's, you should all get an email. I've been putting the emails in. It's supposed to send you emails. Um, Lori was my sample <laughs> and she got hers. So I think they're going and they should all be active and clickable and show you something. Um, I'm just going to put a bunch of these out here to kind of show you where we're at with these. These are different sizes. Just like this one is really awesome. This thing is pristine. Whoa. It's so cool. These are the feed sacks, right? Yeah. Feed sacks, grain sacks. I don't know. It's like a regional thing. It's weird. Like some people don't even call flower sacks flower sacks. They call them feed sacks. So it's like, I. it gets really confusing sometimes. Hi, Lori. So I just stick with what I know that works with what they are. And this one's plain, so I wanted to do that one separate. So then there's this one, which is still sewn as a bag. So like this one is a bag. This one is a bag. I love that one. Jean Moran and Tammy say they they never um, got an email. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Well, it, okay. I'll look. I will look. I swear. They don't make it easy. I'm about to use all my words. Okay. No, Paula said she didn't get an invoice either. No, or Paula, Beth. I didn't. No. You're not finished, right? No, I did invoice. Beth oh. should have hers. Look in your spam for me, Beth. I know I sent yours. Paula, I didn't send yours yet. Okay. So, and then there's this one. There's that one. Wow, those are so cool. Aren't they cool? Yeah. And there's this one. Look at that one. Wow. And this one, I mean, this thing is a mess, but I really kind of like it. Yeah, it's only for the ones that I printed shipping labels on yesterday. 
Oh, Beth said, no, I did get an invoice, just nothing with shipping info is what I yeah. meant. If you, if you paid yesterday, then I've already printed and shipped. The ones from today's, I haven't printed labels yet, so you won't get them yet. You won't get them until tonight or in the morning. So this one is torn all the way across the center and then pinned in place. So this one is actually two pieces. So there's that one. And then is Kathy Behe here? I don't think I've seen her yet. Kathy Behe, I need you to holler in the chat if you're here, because I kind of like to give you dibs on this. This is kind of her thing. Look, it's for guns. Oh. Isn't that cool? Dear B wanted to know how wide they are. They're different widths too though, aren't they? Yeah, each one is different. And these we are gonna do by offer up because I, these are really hard for me to price. I'm just, and I don't wanna go research and get comparison pricing and all that junk. I just, they are, it is what it is. So, these, I will measure them one at a time and we'll put them out here. I'm going to do this one first just to get it out of our system. Okay. So this one, and it's, this one is interesting. I don't think this has ever been sewn together. See, this is, this is one salvage. And then this is the other salvage and there's no stitch lines. And the fold is. Wow, that's huge. It's enormous. So here's the fold. So then you've got the double all the way back up past the print. So like, see there's, there's the back piece. <clears throat> and then this match, this lines up. So you, when I measure it, we'll have um, to double the length. Nice. So then here's your graphics on it. And I'll lay the ruler. Let me grab my ruler so you can get an idea how wide the graphics are. Because it's pretty zoomed in, so it's going to look way bigger <laughs> than it is. So there's 12. And there's... So we'll do like six and a half. So like 18 inches is your design width. Natalie wants to know, is the print on both sides? Nope, just one side. The other side is all blank. So you've just got amazing, um, feels like canvas. This one's really nice. It's dense, it's real tightly woven, but it's real soft, supple. It's, there, it's nice. This one is cotton. It might be a linen. I feel like I can see a little bit of that, um, a little bit of this, the linen slub that you kind of look for, but not, it's not predominant. And there's a little, um, you know how like when they're using a rougher cotton and you can see like little bits of the, what is that? I want to say the hole because I don't know what else to call it. You can see like little bits of that in it. Um, before the chat gets away from me, um, they a few of them were talking about the piece with that you said had to do with guns. Uh-huh. Becky wants you to know if you find any police stuff ephemera, she's interested. You got it. Okay, so this is measuring 28 and a half inches wide, salvage to salvage. And then the length from the fold to the two raw edges, if it was opened all the way. So raw to raw is 76 inches. Wow. Because we're at 38 inches from the fold to the raw edge. Okay. So if you wanted to use this to make pillows or reupholster, I think this would be amazing if you have any like stools or benches or, um, like a cushion sort of situation, not a, ch I mean, I would use it on a chair, but um, I just think it would be great for that. So you can start this one anytime you're ready, Miss Mags. Okay. 
starting at a dollar? Oh, yep, just at a dollar. Okay. Oh my gosh, my Kroger app is still open on my phone. What's still open? My Kroger app. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Is that where you went grocery shopping? Yeah, it's that or Walmart. Those are my only choices. I'm not a Walmart grocery shopper. We have like too many choices. Yeah, I know. That's all we have is those two choices. <laughs> Beth, I'm glad you connected those dots because I really didn't want to call you out. <laughs> oh my gosh, she makes me laugh. Who, Beth? Uh, yes. Beth? Yes. yes. <laughs> She's so funny, I swear. Thank you, Paula. <laughs> okay, let's see here. I want to do this girl next, too. You know, I can sit here all afternoon and not cough, and as soon as I start talking... I know. It's so frustrating. Maybe well, I should sit here and talk all afternoon to myself. Talking is what, you know, like I think loosens everything up and maybe. Okay, here's 30 seconds. <clears throat> oh, I just realized that said Minneapolis on it. Read all the words, Patty, all the words. Okay, let's see. That is going to Karen Thompson for $24. Awesome. Thank you. Oops, 24. There we go. Thank you, ladies. Thank you, Karen. Karen Thompson. Congrats, Karen. A nice job. Okay. So next we'll do this little girl. There was 25 pounds in this bag. I just happen to really like the bag. And then the back side is plain. And that's not like discolored, it's just the color from the front coming through. Okay, so now I'll measure it for you. It is 11 inches wide and I really need my new mat. 21, 22, 23, 23. So we're gonna say 23, 23 tall and 11 wide. And this is a discoloration right there, just so you know, right along that. Right along the seam right there. Just so you know. She didn't even gave her teeth. Do you see her teeth? Look at her teeth. Even her teeth are white. Yeah. Curly white. <laughs> mm. 
<clears throat> yeah, I like that. Me too. She's cute. I think we'll do these European ones next. I have to empty out my basket, though. Hi, Renee Jensen. Hey, Renee. And you guys will have to let me know when you're over the feed sacks because um, I think I have more feed sacks than I had. <laughs> Flour? Yeah. I've been setting them aside for a while as I would find them. And I didn't realize how many I had accumulated. Okay, Paula, did you hit a button? <laughs> no, she's good. She's okay. good. She's good. Thank you, Paula. Oh, there's only one of the European ones. This one I've cut in half. There's only, there's one and a half. One and a half. I think I have more in the trailer, perhaps. I wouldn't be surprised. Me either. I may have to give Sophie a call. Sophie, I need more grain sacks. Here's the 30 second warning. Okay, we're just waiting for uh, StreamYard. Now yep. waiting for StreamYard to catch up to you, too. <laughs> <laughs> it's an interesting little back and forth game, isn't it? It is. Okay, that's going to Karen Thompson for $22. Awesome. Thanks, ladies. Thanks, Karen. Okay. Congrats again, Karen. So, <clears throat> I know there's some of you that are going to be interested in this that weren't here um, it's been a long time since I did these. Um, this is the last full one that I have. I'm going to measure it quick. These are hemp. These are European. Um, when I was going to Texas and setting up at Round Top, um, Sophie, if you go back through my videos and look for the one where I was at, um, more antiques, that's Sophie. Um, she's where I get these and she ships them over from France or Italy. Just depends on where she's at over there. I think these are French. So without being a hundred percent confident, I'm going to say European. This is 44 inches long from the fold to the hem. So if you open it up along the side salvage stitch lines, you would have 88 inches with this red and there's a green there's a tiny green can you guys catch the green that's running right in the center of the blue right there you see sometimes on the no there's the inside i love the inside of this yeah. one. right it looks like baseball stitching right but i don't know if you guys are picking up the green i don't think it maybe there there's a there's a single green stitch that runs through the center of the blue and then the red and this red is it's it's red like 
Christmas red. It's their lipstick red. Lips, I was just going to say lipstick red. Yeah, it is red, red. And then let's see here. We are at, oh, darn it. I need my new mat. So that's 30. That's, so we're at 20 inches side to side and then 88 from here to here and these look at the difference i just oh they're so amazing so there's the inside that's what the weave looks like on the inside wow that's beautiful and then there's the weave on the outside now and these have all been nice and thick for like journal covers Oh, these are incredible. Yeah, they're like, I mean, they're malleable, but you know, they almost feel like lightweight throw rug weight, almost, especially doubled. But um, yeah, so this one I'm going to flat price. Okay. And it's going to be for the first me. Um. Let's do this one for, let's do 60. And if you guys are familiar with these and you look at them around, you know, they can go for crazy amounts of money. It's like make you shake your head kind of money. Natalie said looks a little like ticking. Kind of, but this, this is hemp. It's just, it's amazing. It's absolutely amazing. I know some of the girls in chat have them. Okay, that sold to Karen Thompson. Okie dokie. It did say 60, right? I wrote 60. Yes. I said 60 and wrote 60. 65. Okay. Thanks, Karen. You got a couple before, I think. Which is cool. So this one is a half a one. I've used part of it. I used it on... I don't remember if it was a footstool or a bench. She wants to know if those can be washed. Yes, I I wash them. I just don't put them in my dryer. I hang them to dry, and I wash them on in cold, on cold, in cold, cold water. So here's the patch on this one. These are the insides. This is the patch. Here's the outside. This is where I cut it. So, and here's where it was stitched and I opened it up. So you've got a continuous and there's a stitch, stitch line here. Okay. So I will measure this one quick. So opened up with is 41 inches. Seam to seam with, with a seam here in the center. <clears throat> and then it is... Twenty. I'm going to say 21, 21 tall. So here's, here's a repair. I love the repairs. There's a repair. I'll walk it across so you can see. Here's one. And this is just a nice navy French country blue. Yeah, I love the color. Mm-hmm. And then here's that seam. And I this end has the um, strap that they would have used for carrying it. So you've still got the twine. Oh my gosh. Here's another repair. Here's a repair and here's a repair. But these were just stitched closed, not patched. Whereas this one has the patch. Okay, so this one we will flat price. And this one, um, I'd like to do 20 on, please. Okay. Okay, that's sold. Wow, you could have sold about 20 of those. <laughs> 
All right, let me. That's going to Becky. Awesome. Thank you, Becky. I need to reach out to Sophie and see if she's got some, because you guys really liked all the, the blue ones like that and the blue and red. The ones that were very, like, French-inspired colors. Let's get these out of the way. They're starting to get frustrating. Okay, so then we have this one, which, again, is the whole... You get wow. the front. Yeah, you get the front. And this one is think flower sack weight. Just a nice cotton. Um almost like what they would call it's a muslin, but it's almost like what they would used to call calico calico. That weight of cotton, but kind of like or similar to the flower sacks. Okay, so there's the front. And then here's here's the back. The color comes over just a little bit. So you've got lots, little pre-distressing there, and some pre-distressing there. So let's see here. The 35 by 20. So at the fold to where this side seam would have been is 20 inches. So opened up as 40 inches wide by, I forgot already, one moment, 35. So 35 by 40. Yeah. 35, 35 tall. So the design runs 35 inches top to bottom and then 40 inches side to side side to side when it's opened all the way up. This is an offer up, right? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Oh, that one's from Chicago. That's cool. Okay. Peoria, Fort Wayne, Portsmouth, Omaha, Buffalo, Memphis, and East St. Louis. Nice. Portsmouth, that could be either Maine or... I think there's a Portsmouth in New Hampshire, but I'm not a hundred percent. How do you get an I in there? It's M O U T H. How do you get an I? Uh, it's pronounced Portsmouth. Uh uh. Uh huh. Oh, <laughs> geez, New England. It's part of New England. Man, she's taking that I'm the boss thing seriously tonight. And, and there's no I in it. It's Portsmouth. <laughs> 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 Oh my gosh. Patty I don't loves give you a hard time. My accent. I don't get to give you a hard time very often. I love <laughs> yeah. it. I love it. She thinks I say popcorn funny. You do. Doesn't she? Say it, now say it again without thinking about it. Popcorn. See, now she said it the right way. If she just says it, it comes out P U P. <laughs> if she says it after you go, okay, say it again, then she says P O P. It's hilarious. You do have a oh, cool you know, Hey, Nancy. She says we in Virginia pronounce it just like Maggie does. <laughs> yeah, okay. Sure. sure. And Paula sure. says no one eats popcorn. <laughs> yeah, nobody eats the popcorn. <laughs> and Jody says the same thing, but Jody's in my state, so... <laughs> <laughs> so of course she would oh my gosh too funny natalie wants to know do you ever run across the corn meal paper bags corn meal um, paper bags? i feel like didn't i find some of those when i was in texas and we did the sale from texas i feel like maybe I know I have found the paper flower ones. <clears throat> I want to say yes, Natalie, but I can't remember confidently enough to be able to just say, yep, sure do. Here's 30 seconds. Hi, Jubri. Hey, Ju. 
D. <laughs> wow, way to get stuck on this. Wow. Oh Did you hear my brain click in? Oh my goodness. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh, that was too funny. Oh Lord. Only here, people. Only here. <laughs> Oh, wow. I couldn't decide if I wanted to say Jubri or if I want to say Judy, and I just got stuck. <laughs> oh, my gosh. One oh. moment till my brain makes a decision. <laughs> okay, wow. let's see. Um, there's my stop. Right? Okay. Keep laughing, Maggie. Exactly. <laughs> um, that is going to Colleen for $33. Nice. Thanks, ladies. <laughs> Thank you, Colleen. There we go. And all of these will be in plastic to you guys. So just so as you know. I just don't want to fight with all the bags right now. So this one is still sewn. I think my very favorite thing about this one <laughs> is this bucket. It's like a wash tub. Yeah, that's cool. Isn't that cute? Mm -hmm. And it says to remove printing, launder in, <clears throat> and it, I don't know what it's supposed to say, but it looks like it says USUM. I don't know what USUM is. Hi, Candy. Or usual? I bet it's usual. It would take the um, printing off? I think so. So it says to remove printing, launder in usual manner. So oh. just know, <clears throat> if you find this the washer, you may not have any ink left. Just saying. <clears throat> oh wait there's your mash <laughs> it's not paper though safe efficient and economical and there it is but this one is still all sewn up for you so this one is an actual legit bag so they let's, are energy. <clears throat> let's measure this oh and it's this one is blank on the back too so you're going to have some and this is well except for that that is stamped on there there it is. But see that? Look how soft that looks. It is that soft. This stuff is awesome. Drew Bree says salt will help keep the printing. We used oh, to nice. do it with our racing t-shirts. Oh, nice. Oh, I bet vinegar would help too then, right? Don't you use vinegar to set things too, like in eco printing? <clears throat> or am I just guessing there? So I'm going to say 18 and a half inches wide. and. 35 tall. So each side is 18 and a half wide and 35 tall with side seams and the bottom seam. Feeding instructions inside. Wait, I want to see. Are they? She doesn't know about the vinegar. <clears throat> Okay, well, if the feeding instructions were inside, they were on a separate piece of paper because they're not printed in there. Just saying. Oh, look. Such a dork. This side is folded, so there's only one seam. This side seam, uh -huh. and it runs all the way across the bottom. So if you open it up, you're going to have 36 inches of width. Oh, so it's 36 by 35. I put 18 and a half. But that's okay. They'll, that's okay. That's okay. <clears throat> My bad. They know what we meant. Lucy said, yes, vinegar is used to set. Nice. Thanks, Lucy. I like when I'm accidentally right. Okay, Mags, I'm going to mute and run because the giggling kicked in. <laughs> okay.
Oh, she cracks me up. <clears throat> Ma, it's so quiet. You'll have to wait till she gets back to ask her that, Tammy. You trying to say I talk a lot? No, it just seems so like quiet. <laughs> <laughs> but sometimes you do talk uh, a lot. <laughs> I do talk a lot. I know. I do. And that's okay. It's a good thing because it's, you know, it's just how it is. Yeah, I don't know about you guys, but I feel like you hit an age where sneezing and laughing are sometimes hazardous. Oh, please tell me about it. Right? Okay, there's 30 seconds. <clears throat> You guys okay with staying on feet sacks? Still a couple of cool ones I want to show you. I think they're all cool. I love them. There's so many neat things you can do with them. Okay, that's going to Diane D for $21. Awesome. Thanks, ladies. Thanks, Diane. Okay. So next up, we have this one, which, let's see here. This one is, we'll say eight and a half wide and do, 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 do. do. 16 tall. So eight and a half by 16. And somebody did marker on it at one point right there. You can see where they, looks like it was a Sharpie at one time. So, and then there's the back. And this one is still stitched by the way. <clears throat> so here's the fold, fold side, stitch, stitch even and then the bottom so whenever you're ready it's in there lacrosse wisconsin and grand rapids michigan oh diane's doing a happy dance <laughs> yay we like happy dances. happy dances are way better than pouting yeah, saying, oh, no, my leg. I know. And then the vocabulary kicks in. Right? Well, it does for me anyway. <clears throat> I want to see if everybody starts singing the song when I put this next one up. It'll make sense, I promise. <laughs> <laughs> it's one of those songs that you can't hear it and not do a sing-along. And then it gets in your head for the rest of the night? Yep. Awesome. I know. I'm not going to say it out. I'm not going to. Well, I'm going to try not to say it out loud. I'm for sure not going to sing it. <laughs> Everyone would be upset. Yeah. There's no way I would sing anything. Oof. You'd hear the cats howling. <laughs> <laughs> you and me both. <clears throat> okay. 
Not yet, Lorna. Not yet. Oh my gosh, I bought fudge brownie mix at the store. Oh, you did? I didn't make them yet, though. I'm thinking about it. I'm thinking about it. Oh my gosh, is Melanie here? Melanie has voices in her head sometimes. I don't think Melanie's here. Deborah no. says, I always have songs in my head. <laughs> Oh my gosh, poor Melanie. Remember the first day? <laughs> the one. <Yeah. laughs> oh my gosh, that was so funny, but it was funny because we've all been there. 30 seconds. <clears throat> oh. Yeah, I get them too, only because, you know, the, the grandkids are usually playing something. Right. And it's like it gets in your head. Oh, I was driving them to Chipotle and, um, you know, I said I had the loaner car and Maddie turns on the radio and the song cocaine comes up. <laughs> oh, oh my gosh, God. that's an oldie. Right? Yeah, it was must have been an oldie station. Oh my gosh, I was waiting for the... <laughs> <laughs> Grandma, you they, know that song? Yeah, they just kept quiet. <laughs> Okay, that is going to Paula for $21. Awesome. Thanks, ladies. Thanks, Paula. All right. Oh, my gosh, Jody, Baby Shock. Little June's coming tomorrow, and that's the first thing she says is, can you put on Baby Shock on the TV? Okay, you ready? Yep. Oh, no. <laughs> Oh, no. That's like a seven-minute song, and that's all they sing through the whole thing. I like, know. Freaking words. I know. Oh. Well, no, four words over and over. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my gosh. A hundred pounds of it, might I add. <laughs> oh, my God. I have it in my head. Thank you. You're welcome. So this one is 36 <laughs> inches from the bottom seam to the top. And it is 15 inches um, wide. If you take the side seam out and then unfold, you're going to have 30 inches by the 36. This is definitely, you can see, um, what is that called, you guys? Somebody's going to know. Where you can see... See the brown flecking from the cotton? What is that? What is, I think that has a name, like, doesn't it? Well, my mom used to call it pilling, but I don't know if that's. Well, it's in the, it's in the thread though. See it? See the brown? Uh, yeah. It's actually <clears throat> in, in the thread. Cotton hull, Terry said. Okay. I'll go with that. Cotton hull. I'll go with it. That's what I said, cotton hull. Yep. Yep, we're going to go with it, Mags. Whatever okay. you just said. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my gosh. Hey, it's Thursday. It's Thursday. But you it know? is really a pretty graph. I do like. I do. I like it, too. That's really it's pretty. really pretty. It make a nice, a really nice cover for a journal. Right. Lucy, she must she must have been talking into her phone. Originally by Tommy James and the Shona Ellens. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. It's, oh my goodness. What, and the Chanel's, right? Chanel's. 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 Okay. <laughs> oh, it would be it would be good Christmas packaging. Very good point. Agreed. Timmy, I did not say cotton hoe. <laughs> <laughs> it's that dratted accent, people. <laughs> oh, my God. <clears throat> oh, she said, that's what I typed, but spell check didn't like it. <laughs> well, let me just say, when people do spell what is that called? Talk texting? Yeah, that's what I, I do. 
I love it, especially if they have an accent, because you never know what you're really going to get. <laughs> and especially if they don't read it before they hit the send button, it's awesome. Oh my gosh, I have seriously cried so hard, I have tears <laughs> coming. Beth, with her southern accent, it it really get, it, it gets hers every once in a while. And yours, oh my gosh. I know, I know. I love them. It and I don't fun. usually think to check. I just hit send without thinking. Well, Beth sends it and then she reads it and then she's like, oh. Yeah, I do that too sometimes. But usually it's when you say, did you read what you just said? No, please read what you just sent. <laughs> I'm dying. <laughs> oh my gosh. And Paula just is always attacked by autocorrect. <laughs> oh, she had a good one yesterday. There's 30 seconds. <laughs> Jennifer. What'd she say? Oh. <laughs> <clears throat> Hi, Cheryl. Hey, Cheryl, how are you? Oh, my goodness. Come on, catch up. Yeah. Okay, that's going to Paula for $34. Awesome. Thanks, ladies. Thanks, Paula. Colleen says, my dad's talk text messages are hilarious. Right? All right. This one is only half. I didn't cut it in half, but it's pretty cool, so I don't really mind that it's in half. So this is the wrong side, and you can see it's got that French country blue-red thing. This is um, – I have laundered this, so this – I believe is like rust. I'm not a hundred percent sure, but I'm showing you the back side, and then I'll flip it over and show you the front side and then I'll measure it quick. And this is another one that's heavier. It's almost got that like drop cloth weight to it. Like if you ever washed a drop cloth, the older ones that were really um, very cottony and not quite as canvassy, that's what this one feels like. Okay, so here's right side. Oops, and I'm upside down. Darn it. Here's right side, top side. So here's your top seam, hem, hem. It's a hem, Patty. So there's your logo. And it is a little off center. Yep, Bemis. Yep. Extra heavy seamless. And then there's your rust stains. So I'll measure this one for you, and then I'll give you an idea of the thickness of the weave and the threads. This one is 16 by 41. So 41 top to bottom, 16 wide. And then down here where it's frayed, you'll be able to get an idea of how heavy the threads and the thickness of it. Okay. So whenever you're ready, Miss Mags. It's in. Okay. <clears throat> I figured you had a timing going over there. I do kind of have it down now. Good. Man, I just realized I just asked him. And just yeah. so you guys know, just so you know, I just remembered there's this one also Ooh. that is sits and this one is a whole bag. Just so you know, I don't want it. If these, if this means something to somebody, I want you to know that there's this one coming. That's also a whole bag. Okay. I just got to thinking that I was pretty sure there was two that were the seamless. 
It doesn't say extra heavy, but they're different, but the same, kind of. Just didn't want anybody, dang it, I wish I'd have waited, kind of thing, you know? Yeah, I like the heavy, a little bit heavier weight if you're going to use it for a, uh, a journal cover, right? Yep. <laughs> yeah, this would be really nice. <laughs> Lorna, I'm a bit frayed too. Me too. I'm always frayed around or frazzled around the edges, one or the other. Yeah, I don't do the flu shot. I don't either. I've never, ever had a flu shot. Okay, better knock on wood. Can knock on the wood. Yeah, yeah I had it. Um, when I, I just know if I got one, I would get the flu. And I've heard that people do get it. Well, when I was doing EMS, we had to have it. And ugh, it was the worst flu I ever had in my whole life. So now that I don't have to, I'm like, yeah, no, I'm good. I get sick from Jim gets it and it doesn't bother him at all. I get it and I get really, I get the flu. Or at least feel like I did. That's for sure. Okay, 30 seconds is in. Yeah, everybody upstairs gets it, and I don't hardly go anywhere, so I don't see the point of taking a chance and then getting it. Right. <clears throat> As flower boards. Mm. Oh, I know what you mean. My aunt used to use them, um, yes, when she would make biscuits. Yep. Because the dough didn't stick. Okay, that's going to Christina Hill for $11. Okay. All righty. Thank you, Christina. Thanks, ladies. All righty. Then we'll do this one. That's the whole one. I'm just going to measure it first. It is 19 by 41. So we're going to say 41 from the bottom to the top. And what did I say? 19? 19. 19. 19 wide. And the reason these are called seamless is because it's woven like a giant tube. There's no seam on this side and there's no seam on this side. So you get the whole, the whole tube. This one does have a good size hole along this side. Lots of pre-distressing. So if you want one gunky, and aged, this would be your guy. Then there's Grunge. yep, pre grunged, and it's kind of cool that it says Cincinnati. Okay, and there was a red stripe on the outside of this, but it has so faded, I don't even know if you guys can catch it. It's right. <clears throat> Where is it? Right there. I like the texture on that. You can see it here a little bit. Yeah, right? Yeah, these are all really nice weights. Nice, heavy, sturdy. Janet said her gram rolled out her pie crusts on them. Nice. And Lucy said her, no. Nat, no. Somebody said, oh, Lucy, she forgot. Her mom did too. Yeah, they're pretty cool. I think my grandmother used them to um, knead her bread dough on. Mm -hmm. she, you know, bread. Yep. All the time. <clears throat>
Can you wash these just like cotton? Jennifer wants to know. Yeah, I just don't usually run them through the dryer. Because it tends to twist them sometimes, and I don't like that. Uh huh. Or I'll dry them like maybe halfway and then hang them to dry. Just depends. This next one's pretty cool too. I wish it was a little more pristine, but still cool. <laughs> Bossing each other around over there. Yeah, because they're both bidding. Hey, Candy. Yeah, that's going to start happening. I don't remember who I've said hi to and who I haven't. So that'll happen. All right. Okay. Okay, that's going to go to Becky for 16. Awesome. Thanks, ladies. Thanks, Becky. Okay. So this can be our last one if you guys want to move on to something else. This one is 20 inches wide and 36 inches long. So I think, yeah, the, black, the back is blank. So I'll show you the front. It's really not upside down. Look at it. It's got the whole farm. Oh, nice. Look at that. Isn't that cute? Mm. And plenty of pre-distressing. Wow. Yeah. And then I'll flip it over and show you the back. The back is blank. Mm. Definitely. But see how this one went out of, see how they, they twist a little? Yeah. That's what happens when you put them through the dryer, especially. Sometimes it just happens, but you can see all the stainage or pre-distressing or whatever we want to call it on that one. Okay, so this one, this side is the fold, this side is the seam. And I don't see any holes in it. There's a tear right up here at the top where it was, I don't know, stapled to the wall probably. A lot of times that's how these were displayed. So, but otherwise she's all good. That is very cool. Isn't it cute? So we'll do it that way. So while you guys are bidding, I'm going to ask questions. Do you guys want to, I have some, I have one more that has a, um, like graphics on it. And then there's solid, just like basically the muslin. They're just basically blank. I don't know why I keep saying basically all of a sudden. Um, they are the blank. fabrics different mm -hmm. couple different weights yeah there's a couple different weights there we could do those or we can move right into um vintage embroidery that well if oh. and once they want the prints if they are interested mm -hmm. in vintage fabric prints oh those are pr they're really pretty yeah there's a lot of them we can move into the fabrics if they want and these are going to be by the piece unless you guys really want me to cut them and make um little bundles out of them i can do that too but all except for this little nursery one i kind of think these all work together 
the blue, not so much, but you know what I mean. Yeah, all the yeah, they do. Isn't that cool? <clears throat> it's very cool. So you guys think about it. Let me know. There's a couple more of them here, too. Thirty seconds. <laughs> That's it, Lorna. I'm just looking out for you. You just remember that. Okay, that's going to Colleen for twenty-four dollars. Thank you, ladies. Thanks, Colleen. I know how to spell her name, get it right. Okay. So what do you think? The prints or the solids? Are we over the feed sack for now? Because I could even do oh, I could do that. I could do like a make up some bundles with the plain green sack. We'll call them well, I'm gonna call them feed sacks. And then with these mixed in, what do you guys think of that? Do you like a, a bundle with these and these prints? You mean cutting them up? Yeah, that just now, yes. Because some of these are in small pieces already anyway. And that's. Yeah, can I grab one piece of that? The plane? Sure. Thank you. Sure. Small one, that's fine. Sure. Mm -hmm. Absolutely, Miss Mags. Thank you. You're welcome. They're saying yes. Yes to a kit, right? Or, yes, I, mean, I like that idea. Okay. Okay. So let me put all of this in one basket so that I don't forget that I'm doing that. Leslie and Deborah both like the red. Okay. Which, this one? The um, flower one, I think. Well, they're both <laughs> flowers. This one? They, hang on. Hang on. Because this one doesn't have to go with it if this is the one they like. The large print or the small print? Because this is more like a burgundy. Leslie says, no, I want the red burgundy floral. Right. So I'm assuming that's it, right? Probably. Yeah, the big flowers, she said. Hi, Veronica. That, hey, Veronica. Is that the same one Deborah likes? Um. Yep, big flowers. Okay. Leslie, yeah. They both say big flowers. Let me measure it. And then if you guys want to split it, I'll just flat price it for you. And then we can do this one with the other. And I know I have some other prints, other vintage prints that I can put in there with that. That'll be really nice with it, actually. Yeah, that's really pretty. Okay. Let's see here. So it doesn't go all the way. Let's see here salvage it's been cut i don't think it has the full see it's an oddball situation here all right so this measures let me see there's two pieces that i think are going to come out to roughly the same so 39 by 27, 39 by 27. And then this piece is 43 by. Give me one second, Patty. Yeah, you're fine. So if you guys are okay with me, making two pieces out of this from, oops, from right here, straight across and splitting it between the two of you, I would do it for, um, 
I would do this for five bucks a piece for you guys, if you guys are interested. So Deborah and Leslie. Bye, Lenny. Thanks for coming. If you're interested, just type it in there. Let me know. Yes, Leslie. Okay. Deborah, let me know if you want the other half. Sorry about that. Oh. Leslie wants half. Let's see if Deborah wants the other piece. I told him I okay. would. It. Yep. It's pretty even. So I told him I would do it in two pieces for them. Um, five bucks each. Okay, Lenny. She said, sure, I'll share. Okay, perfect. All right. This one's for Leslie and Deborah. Thanks, ladies. Leslie, five, and Deborah S, five. Okay, cool. Cool, cool. All righty. So then this piece, I just need to know how y'all feel about this one. And do you guys read? My mother <laughs> did our whole downstairs, 1976, the bicentennial year. Everything was like uh, 1776, red, white, and blue, like drummer boys, the whole shebang. The, and we lived in this huge old Victorian house. I mean, 13 foot ceilings. It was a little bit nuts. That's really cool, though. Isn't it cool? I love yeah. the colors. <clears throat> and just so you know, it's not a woven. It is It is a screen print. But, like, here there's, I think this is a five-pound note. This is a book. Here's a pair of glasses. Um, just different. And I th this is the right down the center here. And so then it just shifts. So you would actually have three across the width, three repeats of the pattern. So see, here's where it would start. And then they just kind of offset each other. Yeah. And then there's the other one. Yeah, no, not very Canadian at all. <laughs> Not so much. And this almost feels like linen. Um, I was slightly more confident. I would say that it is. But it feels like linen. It drapes like linen. It's got a lot of the slub in it. See where... Hang on. And then that. this is the salvage. And it's washing it out for some reason, or flashing it out. Oh, yeah. But you see, like, in the... Yeah, it does look like linen, doesn't mm -hmm. it? It really does. And it feels like it, too. <clears throat> it's just really, really nice. So, Jennifer, I'm confused. Are we shout it, just shouting out what we want now? No, I'm just seeing if anybody has any interest in this piece. This is one of those I don't want to cut it up. Unless more than one person wants it, if one or more person wants the whole thing, then I'll just do it, you know, as an offer up. I just, I wasn't sure where to go with this piece at all. And I like the one shoe. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was just kind of looking for some feedback or some direction on this piece. Mm. Or if there's no interest at all. All right. I just well, don't know. Let me put any interest. Seventeen seventy six. <clears throat> and 
And that big floral piece, I think she might be referring to that big floral piece too, but no, that was just easy to put it in two pieces for those two girls. Because, you know, it's kind of like when we find something really cool in orange. Right? Yeah, no. Yeah, okay, no. Okay, no one has said anything. Okay, cool. So we'll set this one aside. <clears throat> There we go. Oh, speaking of which, hang on. I had this piece pulled out to see if Lisa wanted it. Lisa, does this piece appeal to you? It's There's not enough here to... I mean, it's a good fat quarter, but... You're not going to make a list for those um, fabric bundles, right, tonight? No, I'll bring them back when they're done, Natalie. Right. That way I know how exactly how many. Are. Lisa, okay. oh yes. Okay, putting that on yours. Okay. Thought you might. Please, she said. Yep, it's just a nice remnant size, and she's kind of the queen of boating. So, alrighty. I don't know about you guys, but I need... An intermission. Yes. I kind of felt like maybe Maggie was going to be excited too. So I'll put these up here. We'll move to these linen next. Um, this is a set. I'm just going to pile a bunch up here. And you guys, you know, you know the drill. Do uh, shameless self-promotions. You got stuff going on. Holler it out. I know Colleen is live on her channel tomorrow. I finally remembered. Maybe I'll make it. Um, so these, there's just going to be lots and lots and lots of embroidered linens. All different kinds of everything. Huge pile. So you guys run amok over there. If you need your links up, um, Paula and Louise may be able to grab them for you. I'm going to mute and we'll be back in just a couple minutes. Okay, let me catch up here. Hi, Kim. Lori and I are going to be on tomorrow night on Lori's channel. And if you go check, she put up a video today telling everybody who wants to craft along what they will need. <coughs> You're not here? Okay. Okay. Um, Paula, if you are here, could you possibly put a link to... Oh, I can do it. Hold on. I can do it. All right. There I, we go. I am going to link Lori's video from this morning. Oh, Louise just got it, I think. Let's see if it's the same one. 
this will be the link to tell them what they're going that to Louise, do. She's, that Louise, she's quick. She is. And she did. All right. Let me delete mine. Thanks, Louise. You're pretty awesome. <clears throat> Thank you, Louise. Oh, that's okay, Paula. I Nope, that's fine, Louise. I just <laughs> I just forget. Okay, you can do it yourself. <laughs> All right, so eating lunch at 8 o'clock at night. Who's eating lunch? Oh, good, Deborah. I hope you play along. Oh, dear B. Is she still here? She might be. I want to ask her how, because I know she, po remember she posted that she made her own jelly plate. I want to know how it works. If she's played with it yet, if it works. Oh yeah, I saw it. It was still in the pan, but she put up a picture. Yeah. It looked perfect. There she is. There she is. Have you used it yet? Does it work? I've heard others make them. I'm still not going to jelly plate. I'm just beyond curious. She said jelly, perfect. Nice. Or jelly plate. Maybe someday, but not yet. Yeah, I'm going to get mine out. I haven't even opened it yet, but I will. I think the randomness of it is still too much for me. Although I think I have to get some acrylic paint because I think Maddie and Mason both absconded. Absconded? With, well, with um, your accent, we're going to go with whichever version you put out there. <laughs> with my paint. <laughs> uh oh, Lauren has been promoted to Queen B. We are in so much trouble. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. So, Dear B, when are you going to go live in jelly print for us? Yeah, Is it jelly printing or jelly plating? What do you call it even? I love watching you guys do it. I could sit and watch people use their jelly plate for hours. I love watching it. I just know me. It's too, too random. I can't be the one doing it. Oh, they're, t they're talking to you, Megs. Um, oh, I didn't know you could use um, inks and watercolors, <laughs> that type of thing. <clears throat> Lauren is promising to wield her power fairly. Somehow <clears throat> I'm a little <clears throat> hesitant. I'm a little I, hesitant. <laughs> I do have a brayer. Yeah, I've been watching and it's, I mean, it's amazing what some of them come up with. Oh, Marianne says you can remelt it and reform the it. One. Yeah. Oh, interesting. Veronica with jelly plates. Look at all you guys. No, I got mine to do the alcohol names with. Ah, Marianne, so says you. I don't know, though. I've watched so many. And then there's the, what do you do with five? I mean, I'm not going to drag it out to do 10 pieces of paper. I mean, it's going to be like, you know, an all afternoon or half an evening sort of thing. So, do you wind up? I can just, I just have visions of this entire room being covered in wet paper. <clears throat> so I don't know. I just. <sighs> yeah, but you know what? Were you like how, you know, when you're doing the covers and everything and you yeah. spray the ox, you know, with the oxide and all that kind of thing, and yeah. you don't know how it's going to come out. That's yeah. how the jelly prints come out and you can do a ton of them at once that would be right up your alley i don't know we'll see we'll see we'll see yeah, like you said most people do large amounts at a time patty and lisa says let loose patty <laughs> <laughs> if i ever give in and buy one y'all gotta come on with me listen to the y'all i've been hanging around best too much lately y'all 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 gotta come on with me Oh my gosh. Yeah. When I break into Southern, it's always best full. Always, <laughs> always. So we're going to do this blue piece first and get it out of everybody's system. I will say on StreamYard, it is way more. Hmm. It's more of a dusty blue. 
on my YouTube, it's pretty accurate. But in StreamYard, Maggie, don't you think it has more? Oh, now it's changed again already. Well, you see the difference? I was going to say, you know, a couple of the fabrics you showed changed. And I don't know if it's your lighting or do you have... Do you have your, um, what do you call I, it on? I have my alt light here. Let me switch it there. How's that? Yeah. Now it's showing the, okay. like. Yep. I had it on the bright, bright one. Bright. Yep. yep. I had it on Wedgwood the bright blue, one. Wedgwood blue, Natalie's asking. Yes. Wedgwood blue. Yes, ma'am. Yep. So this piece is actually a runner. <clears throat> and it's in really nice condition. Wow. And it's, yeah, it's an eyelet. It's, you know, it's white eyelet on blue is what I'm going to call it. See, it's so pretty. Oh, my gosh. Isn't that pretty? So let me measure it for you. I don't see any holes. I don't see any stains. No spots. Is this going to be an offer up? It is. Okay. Yep. Um, yeah, let me measure it for you. I have all my markers closed. Okay. It is 40 by 13. That's an interesting measurement. 30, no, <laughs> 13, 13 wide by 40 long. Okay. It's not very often I hope a piece has damage so that I can legitimately cut it, but this is one that I was like, oh, wouldn't it be nice if I could cut it and get few people could have it right but when they're in really good shape it's harder to cut them for I'm, sure i'm gonna put that in okay um and if they want a shorter time we can do shorter times too they don't all have to be the three straight. minute yeah we can cut the time down it is changing again do you have your auto focus on no okay that's what I was. I'm sitting here watching it change, like literally. Yeah, I am too. It's right? it's it's weird, right? Right. Yeah. I can't tell what's making it do that. At least it's not just me. Oh no, I see it. I see okay. it in both Streamyard and then on YouTube. Yeah, my autofocus is off. Okay, I just thought maybe it could be that. My white balance is on. Chroma key is off because chroma key makes certain colors really weird. Remember? Uh huh. So yeah, I'm good. Well, I don't know about good, but my settings are where they should be. Let's say that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I don't know. <laughs> no, we're not playing that game, Christine. I checked with Patty. LOL. <laughs> ah, but we like to play games. I just like how they hassle each other. I think it's <laughs> awesome. I love it. Absolutely love it. It's like we all know each other or something, you know? I know, right? It's just fun. Okay. <laughs> oh, no, JJ, it's on. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my gosh, that was too. Look how good I am. I even brought water. Oh my gosh, I feel like a fish. I drink so much water. I do not drink nearly enough water. So I'm really trying. Trying to be good. After we do this one, I think, I mean, there's still some really nice pieces. Don't get me wrong. But um, I want to see if they want to, so you guys be thinking about it. I want to see if they want to shorten it up to like one and a half minute. Oh, yeah, the time. Clocks, yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, 
Okay, let's see. Let's see. Okay, that's going to Cheryl Gobel for $24. Thank you, ladies. Thanks, Cheryl. Cheryl G. That is pretty. pretty. So pretty. Okay. So here's what I want to know. Do you guys want to shorten the time up? And do you want to do a few pieces in um, instead of just each piece? Because we, I can do however. I don't really want to do build a bundles tonight because they're all bigger pieces, and I'm I I because I thought about it, and I just don't know where to go with a price point. So if we stick with the offer up, we can still do like. I don't know, three or four pieces if you guys want. We don't have to do each one by the individual piece. So I don't want you guys to think we're stuck with that. But look at this one. That's beautiful. It does have some broken threads, like there's one here in the red. It's just really nice um, satin stitch work. I feel like there's a little bit of... Um, pulled thread. I don't think it's pulled thread because it's curved. It's got to be like cut threads. I'm not, but then all around this thing is tatted. Wow. Isn't it Derby that does the tatting? Derby, how long would it take somebody to tat this thing? Look at it. It's insanely, look, and there's a hole, two holes. Look, and then all, and then, and then you got to go all the way back again. Look at all that tatting. I would take and, all the tatting off and I would I would um, fussy cut around the circle of the flowers. Right? You know what I mean? She mm -hmm. said a week. Yeah. That's some it's it's a lot. That's and crazy. This, this thing measures 46 46 inches, not including the tatting, just from the red stitching for the hem and it is let's measure at the widest. I put a question in there, people. Is anybody going to answer me? They're not paying any attention. They're just They're not. They're, They're just ignoring us. They're ignoring us. So it's 14 by 46. I'll leave this side with the holes. So what do you guys think? One piece at a time, or do you guys want to do two or three pieces? And do you want to shorten the time? Yeah, we got questions. <laughs> Because there's some really cool stuff. If you guys want it one at a time, we can do that. It's up to you guys. Becky says I put a question. <laughs> I know. Yes, but I have the wrench. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my gosh. I told her she was the boss. She means it, you guys. Right? She's not playing around with us tonight. She said, are they all going to be offer-ups? Yes. Jennifer just put in flat price. <laughs> that wasn't one of the questions, silly. Right. Girl. Karen Thompson says short time. Okay. Um, yes, or flat a few separate. Diane says, you go, girl, Maggie White. <laughs> <laughs> so <clears throat> short. I think, yeah, three minutes. How about if we put it on two minutes? Okay, let's put it that. two minutes. We'll yep. go to two minutes and we'll go to, we'll start with two pieces. And then if you guys want to change it, we will. Okay. So 14 by 46 on this piece. Right. I'm going to leave it with the holes so we don't forget that it has holes, but it's tatted all the way around. Then there's this one. This one is so pretty. Look at the shape on that. Oh, that is pretty. Look at those flowers. And that's all French knots. Oh, wow. The Well, the flowers. And then this is just some straight, I forget. It just looks like slow stitching. stitching. Like what? Like slow stitching? Kind of, kind of. So then this one, I don't remember if there was, I feel like there was something of note on this one, but I don't remember. Oh yeah, there's a few stitches missing and a spot. So here, there's some broken stitches. And then we've got some, 
um, something has obviously, it looks like something bled on it while it was being washed somewhere along the line. But I like the scallopy edge of it. And it's, you know, scalloped along the long side also. So length is 39. I see it, Becky, and I would say no. And width is 15. Okay. So we'll do these two together. What is this? Oh, that's just fuzz from something else. Okay. Oh, and there's a few broken stitches down here on this end too. But then there's the other side. Okay. Let me put that in. Oh. So we'll do these two. How am I going to, there, now you can see them both. Okay. I changed it to two minutes. Okay. Yeah. yeah, and I'm not running any race tonight, you guys. Whatever we get through, we get through. And when we're ready to be done, we're going to be done. Right. <clears throat> that would defeat the purpose, I think, Becky, of the offer up. What? She said, can there be a limit on, you know, how much? Oh, um, no. But if you're really interested in some, reach out and let me know because I have a hunch I'm picking up a bunch more this weekend. Well, that padding is amazing. Isn't it pretty? It really is. And there's so much of it. I mean, there's got to be two and a half yards of it if you trimmed it all off and measured it out. Right. At least, yeah. Probably almost three yards because it was 49 inches and then the, the coming around. So it's probably pushing three yards. <laughs> Shelby. <laughs> 30 seconds. <laughs> They're so funny. Oh my gosh, Christina. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I love them all. Every I know. Them. Everybody has the best sense of humor. I, I know. I love it. There's no arguing. There's no bickering. It's just, right? let's just show up and have fun. <laughs> okay. That is going to Diane D for $22. Awesome. Thanks, ladies. Thanks, Diane. And that's why I feel bad whenever I have to cancel. Toby's like, man. I know. And then it I wonder what I seem like a Monday or a Thursday if we don't right? go on. exactly. So this one does have some. It's almost like when the fabric gets rusted. So I don't know what was stained on it, but it's just really pretty. It's just nice. I can't think of that stitch for the where they make the loop and then they stitch through at the end of the loop to tack it down. Is that the pedal stitch? Is that what that's called? I can't remember. I don't know. I don't remember. And then there's little red French knots. And some of the French knots are pulled. So, you know, if you wanted to use it as is, you'd have to fix those. I love the um, lace that's around it, though. Oh, my gosh. That's lace. That's really pretty. <clears throat> so there's the lace on it. Lazy Daisy stitch. Lord. Yeah. Yes, the daisy stitch. Yes. I was close. Petal stitch, daisy stitch, you know. Yeah. I was in the right ballpark anyway. So there's that one. And then we'll do this one. Oh, they kind of match. Look, purples and purples. I did good. Um, so this one has a nice little crocheted edge all the way around. 
little yellow trim edge, trim, huh, yeah, finish edge, whatever. Row, row, a row. Oh. Again, yep. This one's done really nicely, actually. <clears throat> there we go. You're doing two at a time, right? Yeah. Okay, I'll put this in. And so then there's the back side of that one. And these are all runners. So this one would be like 39 by 14. And then the other one's a little shorter. I'm trying to remember what we washed with this load that was so linty, but there's just lint everywhere on these. fuzz balls. Did you ever go to take your stuff out of the dryer and find out somebody had left a Kleenex in, oh my gosh. in your pocket? So annoying. <clears throat> right? It's usually when my vocabulary goes downhill quickly. Becky wants to know, so is purple thread easy or cheaper in the day? I think it was just popular. Because there's a lot of purple. Yeah. And the lighter lavenderish color, my favorite. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And there's 30 seconds. Oh my gosh, whose dog is that? Outside? Can yeah, can you hear him? No. Almost sounds like a beagle. <laughs> like a beagle. No, it almost sounds like oh. a beagle. It's got a little bit of that howl thing to it that they do. There's a bunch of like napkins. I may do those all in one bundle. Okay, that's those are going to Deborah Spiegel for eleven dollars. Awesome, thank you. Okay. And Natalie wants to know: Is there any more tatting? Um, maybe. I don't know for sure. I'm just. I just literally have a pile here, and I'm just trying to pull some out that kind of color coordinate. But beyond that, I'm not digging too far ahead. Let's do the puppy because you guys saw the puppy. Ah, It's cute, right? So there's the other side. And this is a really nice, heavier um, cotton. It almost feels like a twill, but not, but it's, if this was twill, it would have been like, it's so washed and broke in that mm -hmm. it's like, I would want it to be my pillowcase. It's that soft and comfy. Nice little crochet trim on it. So there's one side. Oh, that's so cute. Isn't that cute? And then there's the other side. And there are spots here. I did not do stain removal, so I don't know if that's going to come out or not. Me too, dear B. I keep some pieces. Look, more of the daisy stitch. <laughs> so there's that one. And then we'll do this one with it. Hi, Sherilyn. I don't think I hey, said Sherilyn. So oh, then that's really pretty. Isn't that pretty? Yes. So this is going to be another one of those like 14 by 39s. Both of these are actually. Lots more of that daisy stitch. Lots of it. Nice crocheted trim. <clears throat> Is the pink um, with purple 
the, a coral color um on the bottom there it's like a <clears throat> more like yeah corals and peaches yes yes it's not as pink pink you know what i mean yes corals and peaches i would say hear him oh yeah i did hear that one I'm like, oh my gosh, who got a beagle and why? <laughs> oh my goodness. They do like to bark, right? They do. <clears throat> they don't always, though. We had one for a while, and she was a really good dog. We adopted her, too. Oh, poor Lorna. She's so tired. She spent the day taking the newest antique ledger apart. Poor baby. Trying to feel really bad for you, but I'm having a really hard time <laughs> mustering it up. Especially since she sent me pictures as a, ha ha, look what I found. <laughs> Lorna. She did. She did. Don't let her tell you she didn't. 30 seconds. She was mean to me. So I sent back, what are you trying to say? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she said I was just sharing my joy. <laughs> yeah. Sure you were. Okay, let's see. I got to scroll up. Um, that is going to Becky for $20. Awesome. Thanks, ladies. Thanks, Becky. Okay, there's that one. Then <clears throat> this one I think we're going to do. No, we'll do it with the, this other set. I was going to do it solo, but we'll do it with. I, I know what I'm going to do it with. Jana keeps putting a G. That's the second or third time I've seen her. Just a G in there. Well, ask her. Not sure. Janet, what are you trying to say? Maybe it's short for G whiz. Oh, it could be. I don't know. I don't know. So here's this one. And this. Oh, that's pretty. Look at the basket of flowers. Yeah. And here's where the lace trim is sewn there's the seam for that so you have three of the baskets i kind of walk this around so you can see it so there's the first one here's the second one. Oh, she said night friends apparently i nodded off and missed most of the offerings going to bed before i dropped my laptop so good she, idea. Yeah, she must have been trying to say good night. There you go. Good night, Janet. Thanks for coming. So here's the third one. And then we're back full circle. Oh, that's and, really pretty. Yeah, and this is just oval, mm -hmm. if that makes sense. I'm going to measure it. And I'm going to measure inside. I'm going to measure the fabric. I'm not including the lace in this measurement because I don't want to stretch it. Um, let's do 28 across and it would be 33. So 28 by 33. For this one. And then with it, I'm going to put... this set like you look at the butterflies Aww. and then you've got these two and these are all hand stitched and then a nice crocheted trim there is a hole or where it's come loose right here and here this bigger one does have I think that was it. Just those few 
Nope, it's got some pulls here too. It's almost like the fabric is trying to fray inside of where they crochet <laughs> on this panel. <clears throat> Good night, Jody. Good night, Jody. Thanks for coming. All of this is salvageable. The actual. Design. Yeah, that's beautiful. Hi, Amanda. Hey, Amanda. <laughs> I love the ribbon embroidery, you know, the flowers. Mm -hmm. It's so pretty. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is done like with, um, it's like not embroidery pink. floss. It's not, it's no. not, I can't think of what it's called. Mm -hmm. It's heavier and it's incredibly soft. It might be silk, but I'm not sure, but it's definitely yeah, heavy. I think like silk, I think they use sometimes silk ribbons, thin silk ribbons. Or yeah, sometimes, yeah, sometimes, yeah. This one is really pretty. It is. <clears throat> There's a 30 seconds. I guess I could go close my window instead of complaining about it, but evidently I'd rather complain about it. <laughs> he or she may win though. I may have to go close my window. Right. <clears throat> I wonder what they're barking at sometimes too. Oh, here probably raccoons. All right, let me make sure that nobody. Especially if it is a beagle because they use them to hunt them. Right. Okay, that's going to Becky for $30. Mary, you were right after Becky and then my awesome. star. Thanks, ladies. Thanks, Becky. Okay, so this time let's do all of these. This is going to be a completely ran. Well, it's random, but not random. So this is a pillowcase. Oh my gosh. I'm going to go close the window after when, while, while you guys are running the clock, I'm going to go close the window. Mm -hmm. I've had it. Yeah. So there's that one. Okay. Especially since I have dogs and I can't get mad at somebody else's dog for barking when mine do the same thing. So there's this one. This one does have a lot of broken threads in it. So this is just going to be a nice background piece. There's this really cute purple lavender one. And then there are three kind of with the fuzzies napkins i think they're napkins because there's multiples of them so they all have the too. same what mags those are pretty too aren't they pretty mm -hmm. so there's three i feel like there was four of these if i find it in the basket mixed in with some other stuff there'll be four of those but as is there's three then there's one this one is cross stitched there's and this again i feel think there should have been four of these, but at the moment there's only three. It's got the pretty scallop all around. Oops. It's got the cut work there in the corner. This one has staining on it and a couple. Well, is that a hole? No, just one hole. I think the other one. Good night, Say Becky. Hi to your sister, please. Yes, please do. And then there's these four that are not finished along the edge. That's wrong side. This is right side. 
So there's that one. There's four of those, I think. Three, four. Yep, there's four of those. Well, she's adamant at the very least. And then there's four of these. And these feel like feed sack cotton. But then there's four of them with the embroidery in the corner. So if you've been looking for some fun cloth napkins, there you go. And there's the pink. So we'll do all of that as one, okay. one bundle. And I'm going to go close that window. There. See how that does. Oh my gosh, Maggie, I broke down and got some more Justin's peanut butter cups when I was at the store. Oh, you did? I did. The dark chocolate? Uh-huh. <laughs> yep, the dark chocolate. They're pretty awesome. Yeah, I love dark chocolate. I know what I can do. I love that oval one. Isn't that pretty? Yeah. That's the 30 seconds. <clears throat> Always amazes me how springy all the embroidery is. You know what I mean? It's always like yeah. so bright and cheerful. Hmm, Christine, no worries. Christine. <laughs> and hello. Okay, that is going to go to Deborah Spiegel for 18. Christine, are you after Deborah? Awesome. Thanks, ladies. Thanks, Deborah. There we go. She said, I find you all very funny sometimes. Well, you'll be happy to know. Oh, my goodness. We really <laughs> amuse ourselves, too. So, you know, the more the merrier. So this one is a tablecloth, and we're going to do it separately. Oh, the schmutz. So there is some staining. Just know that. I know there's at least one hole in this. This is some of the tiniest crochet work ever. So I'm going to pull this up so you can see the embroidery. Oh, pretty. Yep. And then the crochet is such, it's so pretty. It's so tiny and dainty. And this is, this is schmutz, not a stain. So let me get a measurement on this and then I'll show it to you. It's, I um, can't remember if it's square or rectangular. So we're at 44 by, by 22, 23. So it's like 44 by 22, 23, 48. So it's just not square, if that makes sense. But see, so I'm going to walk it through on one half, and then I'll show you the other half. You'll see that there is a lot of spotting on this one. So if you wanted to dye this one, 
that might be a good idea. But look, you see the teapot? Yeah, I love that with the flowers. Mm -hmm. And then I'm just going to flip it over and I'll show you the other side. So it's the three, it's the flowers in the three corners and then the teapot in the, in the one corner. And this, oddly enough, <laughs> the side, the half side, whichever, with the teapot is the side that has the most staining. So I'm, I'm blaming the teapot because it's filled. See, stains, all the stains. And then there's the teapot. Yeah, when I did this, I was really unhappy with myself for a few minutes. I went down, well, I put the, all the really, not, you know, fragile, I guess we would say, antique laces. I always put those in lingerie bags mm -hmm. and do them on delicate. And I evidently forgot to switch it to delicate and I forgot to zip the lingerie bag shut. <laughs> oh no. Yeah. A few of them totally shredded. So as oh. you see me pulling little bits of thread and things out <laughs> and you hear <sighs> it's because it's those pieces that dissolved. Mm -hmm. So pretty much I'm just really annoyed with myself. I just think this teapot is really sweet. I think so too. And I like the flowers coming out because that's different, you know? Yep. yep. All right, there's 30 seconds. It amazes me how much handwork they used to do, or needlework. That's going to Christina Hill for $8. Awesome. Well done. Thanks, ladies. Thanks, Christina. <clears throat> you know, when I used to do the the uh, large cross-stitch uh -huh. pieces, those could take weeks to, you know, over a month to do. Yep. So this is another runner. It's going to be one of those that's, you know, 14 by 40. So there's one side. And it's not orange, it's yellow. It's like yellow. I was gonna say, I don't usually, you know, care that much for or I don't usually work with yellow, but that's a really pretty color. Yeah, it's like uh that harvest see, see the fuzzies? It's yep. all that stuff that just whooshed. Oh, Beth loves the yellow. Yeah, it is really pretty. And it's like that 70s harvest gold color. So which is that one. And we'll put this one with it. Because I don't see anything else in the same color way. Well, actually, hold on. Let's do this one with it. I think, that, yeah, this is better. Because it's got this kind of same yellowish gold color. And this is another runner. So you've got the variegated blues, all the fresh. I love colors. how they did those flowers and the different color, the different yep. shades. Yep. And then here's the fold edge. <clears throat> you see all the little fuzzies. That's really pretty. I love the shape too. Yeah, they, I almost all of these have like some sort of scalloping along all the edges. I just think these would be really pretty to scan and print your own. You know, if you wanted to do yeah. some that not everybody has, these would be really awesome for that. Oh, it's so pretty. 
I'm not going to lie. I've saved back a few pieces so that I can do some that are, you know, I know the whole world isn't using them. I was going to say something and I totally lost it. Lost it? <laughs> I did. Wow. Jeez, I do that several times a day. I'm like, okay, never mind. Then. Mm -hmm. Never mind. Oh, this piece I needed to ask them about. I can't remember what it's called. There's a 30 seconds. And someday when you guys want to do all those really amazing lace all over holiday fancy Victorian tablecloths, holler and let me know because I have an entire shelf of them now. Oh my gosh. It, it, I'm telling you, you it's, you just, it's one of those things. It's like, it's like when Jim and I took those five days or whatever. And all like, every time I turned around, it was buttons, 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 buttons. Tablecloths kind of are the same way for me. It's a little bit berserk sometimes. And if I can find them at really good prices, then it's really silly not to get them. That's going to dare be for $20. We're nice. seeing her right after Dare B. <clears throat> Thanks, ladies. Thanks, Dare B. Okay. So then we'll do. Oh, this. I need to ask. What is this again, you guys? I always mess up and forget. Is this the women's or is this the men's? Whoa, I have no idea what that is. Remember this star that was the, the women's version of, I think it was the Odd Fellows. I can't remember now. The Northern, Northern something. Eastern about, Star, dear. Eastern dear. Star. Eastern Star. Yes, Eastern Star. That's Women what this is, right? Says. Yeah, that's what this is, right? Yes, and she says women. Okay. So if anybody, I don't want to sell this piece. I just need to know if anyone has a desire to be the proud new owner of this piece. These, these are the ones that I just feel like just need to go to the right people. Is it unfinished? Cause I see yes. all that. Yes. It's totally so unfinished. It's unfinished. Yep. See, here's where they started the order. There's where they oh, started. Yeah. But it's all, it's all drawn out if you would want to do it. So, so it's there. If somebody, you know, if you want to type it in the chat, that's cool. If you want to message me or whatever, that's fine too. But I am going to write Eastern Star on it so I don't forget. Yeah, B said I would like it. You got it. You got it. There we go. Perfect. Sometimes those things just need to be in the right hands. Um, so let's do this one. It's another long center table runner, dresser runner. Oh, pretty. Isn't Look that at pretty? that. Yeah. This one does have some broken. I don't know that it's broken. I feel like. 
This is a French knot. There's a lot here. Let me show you. It's almost like the tails where they were finishing have worked themselves up to the surface. It's almost like they just need pulled back down to the backside. You know what I mean? Because nothing is coming loose. So, but there's a lot of that on this end. And let's see what's on the other end. It's like they just tied them too short or something. I don't know. Or maybe they tied them too short and it pulled that back into the, and took out that first stitch. I don't know. Does that make sense? Yeah, this one is an un, this one, it pulled the stitch back out. It's like they knotted, like they didn't know, they didn't knot them correctly on the back kind of thing. So there's that one. And then this one, these are applique on. There's your hem. There's that. And let's put these in there. That oh, pretty. One. Isn't that pretty? Yep. And this one. This one, you can see the whole, see this detail stitch came out on this whole side. So it's not even there like this one. Okay. Oh, that's sweet, dear B. She said, my mother loved the Eastern Star, and I was the head of the Gleaners for children. Oh, nice. Very nice. Hmm. No tears. Only because then I will. Right. Okay. That's a beautiful little bundle. It's cute, right? Yep. This next piece, I think I'm going to do separate because it's, it's not going to appeal to everyone. I think mm -hmm. some of the ladies will be far more interested in it than others. Okay. We'll see. Seconds. We'll see what the reception is. And I have to vacuum tomorrow. There's so much dog hair up here. I feel like I wouldn't dare put a piece of plastic or fabric on the floor. <laughs> It's been three days. I haven't vacuumed up here in three days. I'm sure it's covered in dog hair. Okay, that's going to Mary for $10. Awesome. Thanks, ladies. Thanks, Mary. All righty. This one, I think it'll be pretty self explanatory. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. That's why I was like, well, it's not going to appeal to everyone, but you know, and these roses, I don't know if I'm going to be able to get it to pick it up. There's the finest netting. It's like a pink. Do you see like the netting right there in this? Oh yeah. Wow. That's different. That's really pretty. And then it's just, it's so well done. This is just really, really nice. And this is a nice, this has a nice age to it and the quality of it. It's just, it's really held up well for its age. 
They used to do a lot of this kind of stuff and then they would, I mean, this one obviously wasn't framed, but a lot of times they would frame these and this would be their wall art. So, but yeah, all the flowers have that netting. So whenever you want to start that one, Megs. Oh. Yeah, I'm going to do like this one. Just separate. Yeah, no, I'm going to do this one separate. Just because okay. it's not going to appeal yeah. to everybody. But I mean, I had it ready and I thought I had put it in. <laughs> oh, you pulled a patty, did you? I did. Awesome. I'm like sitting here at my, <laughs> at my clock. <laughs> She's like, yeah, it's in, dork. <laughs> And then I looked up and I went, oh, I didn't hit enter. <laughs> Oopsie. Mary wants to know, um, the last purchase she just got, did that have an Eastern star piece in it? Um, I don't know. And I think I boxed yours already. Hang on. There's a couple of them that are waiting so I could find... She said, if so, she wanted to give it to Dear B. Mm, gotcha. I don't know, Mary. I will look and see. If your box isn't sealed shut, I will look. I feel like yours is sealed shut, though. She said, no, what I just bought. Oh, what you just bought. No, I don't think so. Yeah, I was going to say, I don't, rem I don't remember seeing that either. Gotcha. But Dear B got the other piece, Mary. <clears throat> there's 30 seconds I thought you meant last week's what a goofball I'll get it together here in a minute probably not but it's fun to say Okay, that's going to Diane D for ten dollars. Awesome. Oh wait awesome. a minute. I'm sorry. That's okay. Cheryl was above her for the ten. Okay. And Cheryl and then Diane. I just saw that. Okay, so it's Cheryl G. Yeah, Cheryl G. Sorry, okay. Diane. Your ten fifty was after my stop. Perfect. Thank you, ladies. Thanks, Cheryl. Okay, so. Who asked for the tatting? I, I have been poking around. I did find a piece of tatting. I don't remember. I don't remember either. Was it Amanda? I feel like it might have been Amanda. I don't remember. No, I don't think it was Amanda. Okay. So here's... Re I, yes, Natalie. Natalie was Natalie. Amanda. Okay. So this is just so pretty. <laughs> just so pretty. That's be I love the colors in that. Isn't it? And the heart. Yeah, that's beautiful. Okay, so here's the one side. And then you've got like the single little rosebuds. But do you see how they did these flowers? I'm trying to find one that I think will show up. I really want you guys to see the detail of how they stitch those flowers. Isn't that cute? Wow. I just think it's super cute. Yeah. And then there's the other side. See, here's here's a piece that shredded because it escaped the lingerie bag. I was so irritated. I can't even tell you. Oh, I can imagine. So here's, this does have, it's fraying right here, but they're double-sided. The whole thing isn't double-sided, just where the hearts are is two thicknesses, which I think is awesome because it's that way on both sides. Right. I mean, talk about craftsmanship for Pete's sakes. Okay. Hey, hey K is it K? Did you say K? Yes. Art in the oh, Art in the city. Yep. Okay. K. Yep. Hey, K. So then here's this one. And this has that real pretty 
Daisy. Yeah, that's, oh, I love that one. So there's one side and then it's pretty simple toward the, then here's the other. And again, more of the, the fuzzies. And it has one where I still think this is where they tied their knot off too short and it just pulled it back through. Another fuzz. So there's those two. And then we'll do this piece of tatting next. It's so pretty. At least I think it's super pretty. Okay, that's in there. Art in the city. That makes me think of a song too. Summer in the City, that song, that was the first concert I ever went to. Really? I'm trying to think. Yeah, was that was that um, The Love and Spoonful? No. Was it? No. I don't know. I don't remember now. I don't know. But, but. that was about thir um, 53 years ago. <laughs> <laughs> I was only like 13 or 14. <laughs> oh, my gosh. <clears throat> There's a thirty seconds. It was the love and spoonful. Thank you, Leslie. I thought so. <laughs> I just wasn't sure. Yeah, I'm the wrong girl to ask. I'm lucky if I know the name of a song, let alone who sang it. Yeah, I don't use I don't usually know the names, well, especially nowadays, you know. Yep. All right, there's my stop. Okay, that's going to Diane D for twenty dollars. Oh, oh my gosh, what is wrong with me? <laughs> <laughs> it's actually going to Christina Hill for twenty five. Okay, sorry, Diane, that's the second time I did that to you. Christina was up there higher. She cheated. She went out of order, huh? I'm telling you, they're trying to trip me up. Well, you know, they got to do something to entertain themselves. Thank you, ladies. Thank you, Christina. Okay, so this piece, and then I'm going to do one nice bundle, and then we'll do a few giveaways, and then we're probably going to wrap it up. Okay. Okay, so I hope they like the giveaway. We'll see. This one is the tatting. It does need, now I, I laundered it because I just needed to know that it was freshened up. But, oh, I'm over here monkeying with it. You can't even see it. So this is what each corner would look like if you wet it and blocked it. I obviously did not block it. But look at that, how it, isn't that pretty? Yeah, that's pretty. So this is, I have a piece too. That's just like that, you know, the tatting part uh -huh. and it does do that. Yeah. That particular pattern. Yep. And then there's the tatting there and then see every corner. But if I just pressed it and starched it, that would help tremendously, <laughs> but, or just blocking it while it's drying. Goes a long way. 
but then it's curled. So like pressing would help tremendously, but it is tatted all along. A single, yeah, that's beautiful. And there, I don't see a stain or a mark or a hole. This is a thread. <laughs> this is a thread. So here's here's all four corners with their little dangly doodahs. And this is a really nice cotton. I think pressed out, it would be like so crisp and so sharp. It's really, really nice. I'll measure it for you. It is 17 wide. And I'm not going to count the length of the corner tails. I'm just... So 16 and 16, 32. What did I say? 17? 32 by... Yes. Yeah. 17, 17 wide. There is... This does look like a spot on the camera. I'm picking it up. And it... It might be, it almost looks like a water drop. So it's got, and it's dry. So there's got to be a spot there. Now at least so, this one is blocking it. What is blocking it? Blocking it is when you um, launder it or get it wet and then you stretch it out onto like, not foam board, but something soft that you can stick straight pins in. So you would pull out the shape and pin it so that it dries in the shape that you want it to be in. So like, you know, where my fingers are, you would put pins so that it would dry with the proper pattern. So we'll do this piece on its own. Yep, it's in there. It is really pretty. I haven't seen tatting like that before, like the corners. <clears throat> I almost kept this one and then I decided I would never put it out anyway. It would just live in a drawer. So there wasn't much point. I steam iron it too and, and it comes out if you like hold it as you're ironing it. Uh-huh. It comes out pretty good too. <clears throat> There's the 30 seconds. Hi, Tina. Hey, Tina, how are you? My phone keeps alerting me to update. <clears throat> I have to figure out how to turn the note, the sound off for that. Ugh. Okay, that's going to. I'm going to double check. <laughs> <laughs> That's going to Karen Thompson for 20. Okay, cool. Thanks, ladies. Thanks, Karen. Oh, my gosh, Maggie. That was funny. Wait, I'm double checking. <laughs> well, two in a row. Three well, straight. You know. <laughs> yeah, no. If that's the worst things get, we can live with it. So let's. Do, let's do, let's do, let's do. This one is, I think there's one of these that is damaged and one that may not be. So pull threads. This is the damaged one. So this here, there's damage. Let's see. There's literally pulled broken threads and a couple of spots or maybe, yeah, here's a hole. Um, there's, there was a couple places where the the um, pattern is broken in the <laughs> border, 
This one, I believe, is a linen, linen blend. The fabric is starting to fray and pull away from the stitches in a few places. But down here in this corner, there's quite a bit. And it's broken here also. Okay, so there's that one. And this is another one that's like 14 by 38, maybe, in length. So there's that. And then we'll do this one is really pretty. This one is square. It does have a stain. And this one, I it's got some fraying, but I don't remember that I, it's starting to fray loose here. don't think other than that stain and that where it's trying to fray, but I feel like some fray check might, you know, take care of that in that corner. Yeah. The rest of it's in really good shape in this one, on this one. Look at all the rows of that. Isn't that crazy? Right. And then here's your other side. And a thread. So you've got this spot, yep, and then just that one part where it's fraying a little. So there's that one. Oh, you have more. I just put that in. <laughs> there it was more. That's okay. We'll just do these two. It's okay. okay. Or you know what? While they're going, I'll just add to it. Ha! Because then there's this one. All of these three were the same. Yeah, I love the pull thread look. I do too. And this one does have fraying. You know what? You can just keep, um, how much time did you have on this one? Two minutes. When it gets close, just bump it out another minute for me, if you would, please. Okay. Okay. So here's this one. Mm. I'll just keep adding to it. Then there's this one. I feel like these are tea towels. Oh, that's pretty. Isn't that pretty? I love the lace. So there's that one. Oh, Diane said she's done the thread pull work. Nice. Here's this one. I'm pretty sure this was a hanky. Looks like a hanky. It did come loose right here. Hi, Mila. Hey, Mila. Here's this one. <clears throat> We're wrapping up really tonight. You almost missed us. This one is just nice cotton with just a nice, simple little crochet trim around it. There is a spot. So there's that. Then we've got this piece with the embroidery. And last but not least, whatever this shape is supposed to be. A doily dresser, doily, whatever these thingy dingies are called. Wow, that's a nice bundle. I thought so. I really like these two those two and there's 30 seconds love that piece right there too yep the yep. color and the white Man, I keep reaching for my coffee cup and all that's here is water. <laughs> <Won't Yeah. laugh. laughs> Who wants water? Okay, that's going to Lori F for $24. Nice. Well done. Thanks, ladies. Thanks, Lori. Okay. There we go. 24. <clears throat> Lori F. Awesome. 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 
Okay. So we are going to do, how many do we got? 46. Let's do one to a hundred. It does not matter how many times we have the same number. There's four prizes. I think these are supposed to be tablecloths. I don't know. I don't know, but I'm going with it. There's four of them. Then we're going to have one for one for each of four people closest without going over. Do you want to pick or you want me to pick? You can pick. Just Okay, let me get in private chat if I can figure out where it's at today. Okay, let's do number... Okay, and I'll put the go in. Oh, pencil, ding dong pencil. I just saw your other message now. I've had it on. Oh, um, you're fine. All night. <laughs> you're fine. <clears throat> you're fine. Oh, I'm sitting here waiting to see if they're picking numbers and I'm looking at the private chat. And oddly enough, there's only <laughs> one on there. OMG. Jeez, Lou. Just waiting. Make sure they're all done. See, there's another one. Yep. And another one. <laughs> <laughs> Very nice. Okay, everyone have their numbers in. Wow, these would have been prettier if I'd have gone like that, huh? Where the design was the right way. Right. So this is what you're really getting, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> and now they look more like placemats, don't they? All right, I'm going to put the stop in. Okay. Okay. Oh, the number 35. Is 35. So Dear B has 32. Got it. Jennifer Jane has 31. Got it. And then Leslie and Lori F. both have 23. Nice. Leslie and Lori. Lori, yeah. Awesome. Thanks, ladies. Congrats, ladies. Yay. I just thought they'd be kind of cute, maybe inside of the journal, you know, as the cover so that you're just yeah. the front. <clears throat> just thought they could serve a fun purpose. We'll see. Alrighty, let's see here. I gotta put something on this table while I yeah. Jennifer Jane said I would like to give mine to Linda. No. Yes, I'm just kidding. Just kidding. Linda let's see. That was very sweet of you, Jennifer. Yeah. Thank you. There we go. Okay. So let me grab something to put up here for some color. Shall we? And maybe tease you guys a little bit. And they all say thank you. You're welcome. Mm -hmm. So next time, oh, that's upside down. Next time we do textile night, it'll probably be some of this stuff. Oh, that's cool. Because I currently have tons of it also. I love this one with the cherries and the strawberries. Yep. There. 
Ooh, that's pretty, isn't it? Mm hmm. That might even be more colorful than what they came into. Lucy wanted to know if you ever found her fabric. Um, I think so. I, f I haven't, there's a package, but I didn't open it yet, but I'm going to, and I will let you know. Okay. So, all righty. There won't be any invoicing until Tuesday. <laughs> um, what's all going on? You and Lori are on tomorrow. Tomorrow night. Yep. Yep. On Lori's channel. On Lori's channel. Um, I don't know what's, but I'll see you guys around over the weekend. Probably. I'm going to go see if I can find another, you know, load of stuff. Have a set for winter time. <laughs> nice. Yep. So thanks for coming, everybody. Have a good weekend and we'll see you back here Monday. Good night, everyone. Thanks, Maggie. Oh, you're welcome. <laughs>